वेलकम टू आर चैनल एंड नाउ आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस फ्यू टॉपिक्स इन रेन फोर्स्ट कॉन्क्रीट स्ट्रक्चर्स एंड यूजली वी आर गोइंग टू कॉल दिस एज आर सी एस सो फर्स्ट लेट एस नो द मीनिंग ऑफ रेन फोर्सिंग रेन फोर्सिंग मीन्स स्ट्रेंथनिंग द रेन फोर्सिंग मीन्स स्ट्रेंथनिंग द कैपेबिलिटी ऑफ एनी मेटीरियल strengthening the capability of any material by addition of another material by the addition of another material we are going to call it as reinforcing so now let us know the definition of reinforcing so this is the actual definition of reinforcing strengthening the property of any material or any object by addition of other material other material it means we are going to induce another material within that first material so now uh, in in what way we are going to use this reinforced concrete structures means in construction uh, in construction of any building or in construction of any other hydraulic structures we are going to use this reinforced concrete cement that is usually rcc so rcc means reinforced concrete cement so here we are going to increase the strength of concrete by addition of steel it means we are just adding steel into concrete that is we are inducing a steel into concrete that is called as reinforced concrete reinforced cement concrete so steel plus concrete is nothing but rcc so as we, and why have to we have and why should we induce only steel means concrete is going to concrete is weak in tension so we have to increase the tensile strength of concrete by addition of another material instead of steel we can use other materials like a wood or timber uh, like gold we can use those type of materials also but only why why should we use only steel means the coefficient of temperature of steel and concrete both of them are similar uh, and usually we are going to call the uh, coefficient of temperature with alpha so alpha is nothing but coefficient of temperature this coefficient of temperature is similar for both concrete and steel so for that reason we are going to use this steel within concrete and concrete is it's a brittle material and it is weak in tension and it is strong in compression so we have to increase the tensile strength of concrete so we can just increase the tensile strength of concrete by addition of steel so concrete is strong in compression and we have to increase the tensile strength of concrete so to increase the tensile strength of concrete we are going to induce steel and moreover steel is going to have more tensile strength because it can elongate 
since it is going to have more elongation capacity we are going to induce only steel so th this is the introduction about rcc and before going to the topic the design of any structure or design of, of any building or any hydraulic structure we are going to design it using rcc and that designing involves this, uh, this sorry this designing of rcc involves two methods if i want to design any structure if i want to build any structure first i have to design the uh, properties of the structure means designing involves calculation of calculation of loads providing cross section providing required cross section and reinforcement details so if i want to build any if i want to build any structure first i have to uh, uh, first i have to know what all elements that are required for constructing any building or for constructing any structure for example if i want to build a residential house so first i have to uh, first i have to lay footing columns footings uh, sorry foundation in that foundation everything we are going to get footings and columns all these things but foundation is the basic thing for any structure so after foundation we are going to lay columns columns beams slab and these are all components of building so for for designing all these components i have to follow certain code so for designing of all these of all these sections we are going to follow some code that code is nothing but is 456 so using is 456 we are going to design this elements so design for designing all these elements all these elements in the sense components of building components of the building in the sense beam column slab these are the basic components which are required for the construction of building so for designing all these elements or all these components we have to follow certain code so that code is nothing but is 456 2000 so using this code only we are going to design any structure